Right guys, so I've had a little bit of an update and apparently it's been a murder. Sorry about that noise, but apparently it's a murder investigation. That's a dog. So this is the second part of the video. It's gonna be a murder investigation. How wild is that? Look now they're in there. Oh you're hard. So I got an update off uh, some people that I know and apparently someone, there's a murder investigation going on here. That's why they're so uh, cagey about it. Now, the CID, uh, the key are there, the guy was on his own and then We went into this business here, this kitchen and bathrooms coast there. That's where the CID went into. Right? Now I've had an update that it's a murder. So you got the CID there, the coppers are there, and they've gone in that building there. Isn't that crazy? So I've just actually put the first part of this on the YouTube. But uh, I thought I'd come back out and get more details of it. Look at that big dog. Whoa, can't really see it, but... Isn't that wild? I want to see if the body comes out of there. Well, I don't want to see it, but... Let's see what's going on. Yeah, so apparently this is what they're investigating. Right? So I want to see what's going on here without bothering them. I've already bothered them, so apparently this is what's going on. We've been here about three hours now. There's a CID, a little unmarked car. There's two coppers there, a CID there as well. A CID there. And as you can see, it's intranent. It's round here. In East Lothian. Now you can see the back there of the the building place where they loan you stuff and this has been there all day so they're in the Elder Street Motors now they're in there now I can't bother them too much more because I've already been bothering them so they'll say I'm harassing them or causing them alarm and distress how they work, you see. No wonder they didn't want me to go near there. But we are here and we are investigating. There's the CID mobile. So, what has happened here, guys? What has happened? Hangman audits on scene investigating. 
Should have brought a chair out here with me. I wonder what they're gonna find inside there. Well, I don't know if it definitely 100% is uh, a murder inquiry, but I've got um, good information that it is. And as I say, it's all abandoned and that, so... Don't mark me on the words though, but that's what I've been told. Is it a murder investigation or is it just a small crime? Don't know. As I say, two CID, two coppers. So I don't know. We're going to keep on the scene reporting. Give you any updates. As I say, it's nothing to do with the, well, I haven't said it, but it's nothing to do with the businesses around here. So, I uh, don't have any thoughts or opinions on them. It's just a local incident that's happened. Elder Street Motors, I believe, is a place where you get MOTs, repairs and services. Now, as far as I know, it was, all right, mate, it was open on Friday, just gone there or something. There's containers here, and as I say, the CID went over there, but now they're in the street motors place. Now, they didn't want me to go down there and round the back, so I can only wonder what's happened. I can only but wonder. We are going to stay and try and find out, stay a bit longer and try and find out. There's a local shop, the local areas. As you can see, it's quite a little busy place here. Not too bad, like. But yeah, uh, so let me know, guys, if you know what's happened here. Let me know if you know what's happened here. Sunday afternoon, you see, 7 o'clock. So it's not like it's uh, during the week and stuff. The new roads have just been tarmac, look. All the new road markings just been done. Freshly tarmac and stuff. Now let's see if the CID is actually looking around the back of the building. Let's see what we can see. So that's the police. That's the... Let's go over here, because as you can see over here, there's a little bit of a better vantage point. So we're going to go and see if the police are around the back of there. Now they're looking to see where I'm going, but this is all public, so let's go and have a butcher's. That's the back of the building, so as I say, you can't really see anything uh, from the back. Let's go and have a look. Investigative journalism. So as you can see, that's the back of the premises and uh, 
but down here it's just an old digger and just there so I don't know I don't think it's anything to do with these haulage yards Isn't that crazy? Look at that Leyland one down there. Look at that one. Don't actually know what to do there, to be honest. But it doesn't seem like it's round the back of there anyway. Look at that old truck there, the old tractor. Nice drag there. So it's be very interesting to find out what has actually happened here. And as I say, it's a breaking incident. I don't know what's happened. I'm just walking around the public parts. As you can see, this is down towards the shop, and then the police are on the right there, on the right hand side. There they are there. See, as you can see, it's, uh, it's not very accessible via the back there, unless you go through the business. The CID is still inside. Wonder if they found anything. Got a wonder, ain't you? They've been in there quite a while now, guys, maybe about 20 minutes. Maybe been in there about 20 minutes now. Should have brought a chair out with me. Sit down and wait. There's no other police or private vans turning up if there was a body or anything, so there's no more police coming yet, so I don't know. What's happened here? That little dog. Oh. Hey, pal. Oh, lovely. See, I can't really see much going on, but 
the CID have been in there for 20 minutes, so there's definitely something going on or something inside this building here. Uh, you know, and you're quite free to stand in public. A lot of people are walking past and like staring and stuff like that, but you've got a right to film in public. That's the whole point. Anyway, we can always clip down the video and uh, chop it into smaller parts. What is in there? And this all must have happened the last day or so because, as I said, I'm sure this was open on Friday. I'm sure this was open on Friday. <coughs> so let's find out. There's no more police vans or ambulances or anything coming, so I don't know if that report they had earlier of the incident, the serious incident, was true or not. Well, as I said, they've been here about three or four hours. We'll chop down the video. We'll take the highlights out of it or whatever. But yeah, as I said, we're not highlighting any uh, businesses or anything like that. We're not trying to promote what's happened or anything like that. All we're doing is reporting on the local instance. The local incident, sorry. That's all we're doing. Reporting on the local incident. Well, I know this has been going on here today. Look at that guy there. Oh, his Jaguar has been attacked. So if he's part of this, we can see his Jaguar has been attacked. Or he's crashed it. Look, there is some damage there to the wing of that Jaguar that's been fixed. Well, that's maybe the owner of the business. Maybe informing him what's happened, look. Look at that Jaguar, you can see it's got some damage on it. What has happened here? Maybe that's the owner. That guy's come up to talk to him, but he was just saying about the business and then that guy's all right, so I don't know. Hopefully he's all right and safe. As I said, we're just reporting on the local instance incident. All right, mate. No, no, sorry. Do you know David? Uh, the guy aye, from aye, here. Aye, aye. No, aye. mate. No, no, sorry. I just do uh, a little bit of reporting. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I'm the police, okay. and I was just reporting no, the no, local no. incident. It's just that it's a power bin. I've got to get a hold of it. Is there something bad uh, that's happened? I have no idea what's happened. I genuinely have no idea. Well, the word on the street is there's a murder investigation. Is that correct? I've never heard anything like that. No. Uh, no, 
I'm not filming now, but all right, then, mate. I hope you're all right. So that guy says no. That's not right. So what is going on here? All right, mate. But anyway, we're going to leave them to it. I know. Uh, if we can get any other further updates, then. I don't know. Let me know what's happened, guys. I think regardless of what's happened, guys, we're going to let him get on with it. So that's Police Scotland there. We're sitting up there. We don't know what's going on. Uh, let's leave him to it. Let's leave him to it. If you get any more updates, we'll be on it.